Hello, 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 my YouTube subscribers and my subscribers to be. Thank you once again for tuning in to Celebrity and Variety Talk. I'm your host, Josie Latimer, coming to you tonight with the breaking news story about R. Kelly, which I know many of you have already heard about the story. The story of the old news with R. Kelly and Aaliyah. The news was old. But the charges are new, you guys. Um, I wonder why they're just now bringing up these charges. R. Kelly already is going to be locked up for a long time, if not for the rest of his life, it seems like. And they just keep bringing out old dirt on him. Which, indeed, if you commit a crime, you do have to pay. However, uh, the crimes that they have him in there for now is enough crimes to put him behind bars already for the rest of his life. How much more time can you get more than life because of the fact of his life, his lifespan and the time is already past his lifespan and, and now spanned. And now they're coming up with these charges about Aaliyah that he bribed someone to do fake documentation so that Aaliyah could get married to him at a young age. Well, I'm quite sure they knew that way back then. So why now? Like I said, it's a bit late for that because R. Kelly already, he's facing enough time past his lifespan. So what I'm saying is all this for publicity because it is R. Kelly. Um, he's already paying for his crimes now and like i said the charges he have all these charges against him that can keep him behind bars past his lifespan so uh this stuff with uh, Aaliyah, a lot of people got paid then but now everyone's coming out including they said Aaliyah's mother has something to do with it and she's not saying anything so my take is that if they're coming after r kelly for bribing people um, getting documentations to help her get married to him at a young age. What about her mother? Where does the mother fit in at? Because anytime you are underage, your parents should be there by your side at all times, should know what's going on at all times. So I'm wondering if they're going to open up a can of worms on her as well. What I'm saying, you guys, I'm not saying anything is right if he molested a child or did anything wrong to an underage girl. But what I'm saying at this point in time is that R. Kelly is already locked up in jail and it seems like they have already thrown away the key. So they can't, it's nothing else they can do past his lifespan. So what are all these other charges about? I mean, you know. He's already in there for past his lifespan from what all the charges that they have against him and supposedly allegedly have the evidence against him. Uh, that's my take on it. I don't know what you guys think, but that's just my point of view about it because um, they're steady digging up dirt, digging up dirt. I think it's for publicity to make everyone look good that finds the dirt or finds the information uh, about the situation, but where were they when it actually happened? The same people that found this information and this evidence to bring more charges against R. Kelly should have been there at that time to bring those charges against him then, and possibly he would have already been in jail and did his time for that already. You see what I'm saying? So now they have linked it in with the time that he's got to do for all these other cases. And if he get sentenced, that's going to be past his lifespan already. So where were they then when he could have did his time? If that was the case, they should have been looking into it at that time. But to bring it out now when it's a bit late because Aaliyah is gone, R. Kelly is in jail for maybe most of his life or all of his life, what more can they do? So it's got to be for publicity. I, I really think that's what it's for because the same people that found all that evidence should have 
found it a long time ago. That's just my take on it, you guys. And I'm going to end it with that. So please click like, share, and subscribe. And I'll be coming back with more of Celebrity and Variety Talk. I am your host, Josie Latimer. Talk to you soon. Bye.